Hey guys, so first off, happy Halloween. And and as promised, here's Lego Friends Holiday Special 6 Halloween. I really don't want to give too much away on the episode because it's going to be really spooky and awesome. So it's pretty much going to be spooktacular. But here are the three key things to remember during the episode. Heart Lake, Death, and Reappearances. So let's go. I am so excited. It's Halloween, but it's so early in the day. I want to get in my costume right now. Olivia, come on. It's 10 in the morning, for Pete's sake. But I have a lot of makeup to do. What could you possibly be doing makeup for? You're just a cat. Hey, I am a very gorgeous and intricate cat, mother. <laughs> yeah, so pretty much, I'm going to dress up as a lion. Well, Keisha, that's really cool. Matt, I cannot wait to twin with you tonight. We're going to be peanut butter and jelly, the cutest sandwich ever. Okay, Jacqueline, a little bit more work to do, and then we're off for Halloween. Party! Woot woot! What the heck? It was your average Halloween in Heart Lake City, and everything was beautiful, the leaves were changing, and everyone was getting ready to have one of the greatest days of the year. But around 10.30 a.m., things began to change. Okay, time to take some really great shots of Heart Lake City in the fall for the website. Amazing. What the? What in the heck is that? It's floating towards me. Oh my god, that's a coffin. How did a coffin wash up in Heart Lake? Ew, look at all the seaweed. Emma, Keisha, I need your help. Now what the heck is that? I thought you were taking pictures for the website. That's really not appropriate. I know that, Keisha, but this washed up in Heart Lake and I don't know what to do with it. That's so creepy. A coffin washed up in Heart Lake, full of seaweed and all decaying and gross, on Halloween, no less. Two hours later, after much deliberation, Keisha had an idea. Trick or treat! Oh, hi girls, you're so cute! Disney princesses, I love it. Here, take one. Everyone in Heart Lake City, get to Heart Lake now, now, now! It's an emergency! And believe it or not, within a few minutes, everyone in Heart Lake City lined up around the lake to check out what Keisha was yelling about. Hello everyone, thank you for coming. Hi, as you know, I'm Megan and I take pictures for the website and blog of Heart Lake City. And today I was taking some pictures of Heart Lake for the website about what it looks like in fall and something washed up. Now we all can see that it's a coffin and we can all see the decaying and the seaweed. But what we don't know is why it washed up on Halloween from Heart Lake. It's spooky and scary and we didn't want to open it up alone. That's why Keisha gathered you all here today on Halloween afternoon to see what exactly washed up. It could be a dead body! That's really scary. Olga is fearful. Girls, this better not be some clever prank. Because if Keisha's involved, then there's a 98% chance that it is. Hey lady, why would I try to scare the whole town on Halloween? What kind of biatch does that? Keisha? What? We were all thinking it. Well, since I'm a professional with science, I just think it would be best if I opened it. Whoa, oh wow. Here we go. <gasps> oh my god, it's a dead body. This is the best day ever. Keisha, you're such a creep. Oh, I know what this is. This guy died about 100 years ago in Heart Lake in a boating accident. Sailor James. That's so creepy, I can't even take it. The story of Sailor James was that around Heart Lake, this time long ago, 
his boat was attacked by a couple of humongous sharks. He was survived, but he wanted to be buried at sea. Here's the body now, a hundred years later. Whoa! What should we do with it? Well, this old guy's wish was to be buried at sea, and that's where he's going to stay. So say a few prayers and we'll push him back into Heart Lake. And that was the story of Sailor James on Halloween in Heart Lake City. The rest of Halloween was amazing. They all got tons of candy, went out with their friends, had parties, and did crazy things that all people do on Halloween. But that wasn't always the way things were. Long ago, there was no Halloween. But now that there is, everyone loves it and it's some people's favorite day of the year. Hopefully, it's one of yours too. I know it's one of mine. Comment down below your favorite holidays. Happy Halloween, and thanks so much for watching today's episode of Lego Friends. I hope you guys liked it and liked the little spooky story in it. And I hope you're looking forward to other videos on my channel. Okay? Bye, guys. And remember to like and subscribe for more.